Public Auto Works number two. This is Jamie Bernals. This video production is sponsored in part by RD Sales and Service. We service what others sell. For all mechanical repairs, trust our professionals. RD Sales and Service is a proud sponsor of the number 17 Super Truck and Sprint Car. Hey, is Mr. Excitement on the front row by himself or what? Rennie Polico is on the front. Glenn Manning should be joining him. Oh, boy. Glenn Manning is scheduled to start outside of row number one. Maybe he's just, uh, well, maybe he's playing a little bit of head games here. Oh, there he goes. Here I am, he says. Here I am. See? Could have been some head games. Might there have been nothing. There he is, yeah. Had me confused, so. All right, super truck heat number one on the racetrack right now as we get set to go racing. Green flag. Green flag is out. Great racing action into turn number one and two. And oh, the number five doing a great job. That is the LD electric number five of Glenn Manning. He raced super trucks for years, took a few years off and is now back in the LD Electric, Neil and Nick's Lawn Care, number five. Look at the battle for second, third, and fourth. In the second spot is Derek Pollock in the 29. He owns the rental car business here at Red River Co-op Speedway. But look who's coming up now in the Dynasty Bathrooms, number two. Jamie Vernaus in the Link Auto Works Dynasty Bathrooms. Joey's only number two up to the third spot. Tavia Dorge right there as well in the RD Sales and Service number 17. Glenn Manning is getting away from the pack now. Vernaus trying to get underneath the 29 of Pollock. Five laps remaining here in Super Truck Heat number one. Four to go. Glenn Manning continues to pull away in the Neil and Nick's lawn care number five. He is looking good in that Chevrolet. That's an ex Murray Cozy truck. Just three laps remaining now on the Pepsi board. Derek Pollock holding on to the second spot on the 29 car, or truck rather. Third spot is the two of Vernaus. Next time around, your leader, Glenn Manning, will be around to take the white flag indicating just one more lap to go. He started outside of row number one in the second starting position and is now your leader, one to go. Jamie Vernaus in the third spot will have one final lap to take a stab at the 29 of Derek Pollock. This race will go right to the finish. Well, Glenn Manning, your leader in the middle of three and four, looking smooth. He has been very smooth and consistent throughout and he's gonna take the checkered flag, Glenn Manning, followed by Derek Pollock, Jamie Bernaus, and then the RD Sales and Service 17 of Tavia Dorge, followed by Mr. Excitement, Rennie Polico in the 73P. Well. Look, you guys are gonna fight. You're gonna have to do it someplace <laughs> else. We got work to do here. Ah, uh, boy, oh boy. <laughs> Hey, uh, if you, you want to uh, go over there and visit Victory Lake maybe for a while? <laughs> hey? hey, we just had a set of car keys turned in. What are they for? Car. Ferrari? Uh, I don't know. It looks like car key. No, no, it's a GM key. There'd be no Ferraris parked in this parking lot. That'd be <laughs> at the pavement races downtown. <laughs> uh, there's house keys here. There's an immobilizer. There's, uh, if you can identify them, you can have them. Well, we got another truck race coming up. Sure do. Put the gravy on the lineup. I'll take it back and get to work here. All right. Starting on the pole in heat two, the 22, a rookie is Danik Picton. 
To his outside, a guy that went for a ride last night off the end to turn one, George Balkan. Inside on row two, the another rookie is the 67 of Mark Zondag. Outside of Mark is the 18 truck sponsored by Ann's Brothers. Dustin Ann's on the back, Marcel Picton driving the number 15. All right, we're lined up and ready to go. We're going around just to make sure we get the lineup right. Marcel Picton, if you're looking at the lineup, just an interesting side note here, or you might find it interesting, you might not. 22 truck is Danik Picton. His dad is Marcel Picton in the 15. So. It is interesting. Here we go. We're going racing. Ken's listening to us right now. Pay-per-view tonight on Manitoba Racing Network. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, the, uh, the only guys that aren't getting paid is you and me. George Balkan doing a great job. He had problems last night in the hit re heat race, or the feature, rather. You know, there's a few of these trucks for sale. The number one of George Balkan is for sale. The 29 that uh, Derek Pollock was just racing is for sale. If you're looking to get into truck racing, there's a few good ones for sale on hand. Good race for first place up front. Five laps to go, three down and five to go. The Dynasty Bathrooms number one of George Balkan pushing up just a little bit as they exit the corners, but Dustin ends in hot pursuit in the 18. The Enns Brothers 18 tries the bottom of the racetrack and they are side by side out of turn four, but the one of George Balkan holds on to the lead. Great race for the number one spot. And right now they are door to door again in turn four. And George Balkan hangs on to the number one spot for lap five, but the 18 of Dustin Ends appears to have enough on the bottom of the racetrack to get up alongside of Balkan in the one, but unable to pass at this point. Although he's going to have to get it happening because this time by, two to go. Top four trucks draw for feature starting spots. Top four. Again, Dustin Ends in the 18 goes to the bottom of the racetrack, gets to work on the leader. George Balkan in the Dynasty Bathrooms. Balkan and Sons, Plumbing and Heating, number one. White flag shown this time, one to go. One lap remained, and that race rages on in turns one and two of ends. Wants that spot. It's now or never. Balkan with the lead heading into turn three, but ends once again. Stays right tight inside, but your leader will stay, and he will be the winner. In the Lennox Balkan and Sons Dynasty Bathrooms, number one, George Balkan grabs the checkered flag. Second spot goes to the 18 of Dustin Ends. Third to the 22 of Danik Picton in the fourth and final draw spot, the 67 of rookie Mark Zonday. Well, we move to the Wazota Modified Division now. These are the alcohol burning modifieds. Uh, the differences are these cars different from a B mod. You saw them out a bit ago to the A mods. Is well, the engine is drastically different. Of course, it's an alcohol burning 360 cubic inch maximum with a four barrel carburetor. They use a Burt transmission as opposed to the uh, the B mods use a Power Glide with uh, pump gas or ethanol, depending on.